Hello guys, it's uh, Bartosz from Aviatech Flight Simulators and today I would like to share with you the latest feature uh, of our G1000, which is an option. And so we were always wondering and trying to figure out what we can do to make our products more flexible so we can use it in more configurations and more aircrafts with more avionics. And the idea actually came from one of our clients. Thank you, Raul. Um, and uh, so he approached us and asked, hey, can you add uh, touch capability to your G1000? And, and I thought, what a brilliant idea, because nowadays we see more and more touch-based avionics. Uh, so that's exactly what we did. We added uh, touch capability to our G1000. So you can use it with uh, touch-based avionics like the GTM series from Garmin or you can use with uh, pretty much everything you want. You can create custom gauges, uh, custom buttons, uh, custom switches, everything. Uh, so yeah, let me show you how it looks and how it works. So as you can see, uh, physically and visually, the uh, screens hasn't changed. The bezels are exactly the same. Uh, the only thing you will notice that the screens are a bit more glossy and that's because we use the uh, same kind of touch panels that you can find in your smartphone, so they're tempered glass, and they are uh, capacitive uh, touch, which means that you can have two, uh, for example, uh, using gestures, right, with your, with your two fingers. And in this, for example, we have the very common configuration with the Garmin GTN 750 on your MFT, uh, and you have the classic six pack on your PFT. This is also interactive. You can interact with all the gauges. This is done via Air Manager. And using Air Manager, you can actually uh, create a lot of very nice configurations. You can, for example, have the GTN 7500 or other kind of touch avionics here on the MFT screen. Uh, let's say here on the right side. And you could, for example, display engine gauges here or you can even create, for example, custom buttons, like a touch buttons for your, uh, for example, for your navigational lights uh, and all the other cockpit systems. And you could have six pack here on the left or even more gauges here on the left. And of course, all the buttons uh, of the G1000, you can still use those. You can assign, uh, you can, for example, use the, the autopilot buttons. Uh, you can even uh, assign each button to some custom um, option if you like. You can also, for example, like in the 750, uh, we have the, there are not many buttons on the bezel of the 750 itself. It's only this knob and the direct to button and the home, but you can still, for example, assign the direct button to the direct button on the G1000. This knob you can assign to your FMS knob, etc. So it's all very flexible as always. So this was the very quick overview of the touch capability we added to the G1000. I hope you liked it. And as always, if you have any questions or concerns, do not hesitate to contact us. And as always, happy flying. <laughs>